to master the layout and inherit design from layout, we need to install a package in our application. It's Express EJS layout. Let's install it. After the installation is done, let's import it in AppJS file. Assign it in a variable and use it. Now save it and add one EJS file in views directory. Name it layout.ejs. Write HTML, select HTML5 abbreviation and press enter. Now let's call the body field of AJS layout where we want to render all our view. We have to call the body field of AJS layout using less than, percent sign, minus sign, and the field body, and close it using percent sign and greater than sign. Now let's add a header. and add a footer. Now save it, go to index.ejs view and pass a message here. Now restart the node server, go to browser and reload the page to check. Great, our layout is mastered and design is inherited. Now let's pass more data to view and print it. Let's go back to Visual Studio Code again and go to index.js file in roots directory. We pass data to view as object. Here we can see when data is passed in title field. Let's change the value and save it. Now let's go to index.ejs view. And here we can see we are printing the field. Now let's restart the server. Go to browser and reload the page to check. Great, we can see our latest message. Let's go back to Visual Studio Code again. Go to index root. Go inside function pass to base root. Declare a variable. Assign an empty array and in the array, let's pass an empty object. And in the object, let's pass data as key value pair. Now let's duplicate the object and change values inside object. Now declare our field in the object passing to the view and pass our data. Now save it, go to index.ejs view. Let's create a code block, write a for loop, render the array and print it. Well, Whenever we write Express.js code, actually it's JavaScript code. Then we create a code block using less than person sign and person sign greater than. And when we print any data, then we add one equal sign after less than and percent sign. And when we call body field of EJS layout in layout, then we use less than percent sign and minus sign. Now let's close the for loop. Save it, restart the server, go to browser and reload the page to check. Great, we can see our data. Now let's integrate the SB admin template in next lesson.